Hello, I'm Scott Brown with Green Wind and other home energies. You look across the horizon here, and even over there where you just really can't see much, we're at the 264 mile marker, somewhere around Sweetwater, by gosh, Texas. You see all them wind, wind daisies out there, wind turbines. Not too sure, I think they're all festival, but as far as you can see, that's what you see. All on one side and a long stripe. And we're still away from Sweetwater. Sweetwater is one of the biggest wind turbines farms across America. Alright, I've got you a little bit more footage. I'm at full speed. That's the best this thing will do. I know there's a lot of wind sound. Here's another section. Right, oh, there we go. Got what, we call, got what we call a pump jack, pump it home, a little small rig. As far as I can see on that side, I like the ones at the top of that hill right there, all on the road. Well, we're in Sweetwater now. Here's a nice version of a vertical axis wind turbine. It's got airfoils. Notice the flat side is on the outside. Five blades. I like these. And a little shack right here. If you notice, there's wires coming out the bottom right there. And they go up over to the telephone pole and then back over here to the little shack. That's a money-making unit right there. Okay, I took the liberty of stopping this because I really wanted to share something with you. I think this is a very ingenious way of doing things. This is one of the five pieces that come out or your pipes that come out. This could be a home brew as well. Very easy. You'll notice right here I've got red dots showing where each of these little brackets right here that are in green are pivoting at. It pivots here. You notice there's a little turnbuckle. You notice that this adjustable turnbuckle right here where I got the yellow dots on all the way around uh, connects here before the pivot to where this is solid and goes out to the bracket and by making this longer or shorter you can adjust these blade angles to get the optimum performance probably a homebrew it might not be but I think it's pretty ingenious and my compliments to the man that designed it Sounds like it's windy out here, but basically it's really not that. I'm looking at probably about seven, eight mile an hour winds right here. It was hauling a minute ago, and we had about 15 mile an hour. Well, just on the other side of Sweetwater, by gosh, Texas, another eight miles is Roscoe. That's the grain elevator. And around, so you can hear me here, I see lots and lots of wind turbines. close-up view here. All over the place. Well, here we are, Sweetwater Lake, 16 miles south of town. And we look up and we still see more winter. swimming across this lake, down quite a bit, downhill kind of here. Anyway, uh, the last place we were looking at on film was in Roscoe. That was eight miles west of Sweetwater. This just goes on for a long, long distance. I'm Scott Brown, Greenwind, and other home energies. Many good things to you and your family.